Hey everybody, and welcome to another session of Train Simulator 2013. Today we're going to play uh, career mode. You can see I have uh, the mission Duff Call selected on the Great Western Main Line. The description is you are bringing a shipment of coal to Dicker Power Station from the Midlands. Complete the delivery, then clear out some empty wagons. So basically some uh, freight moving coal should take about 30 minutes on medium difficulty if you're ready and let's go There we are. Been held here to allow other traffic to use the line ahead. Proceed to did card as signals allowed. We'll have a yellow signal, meaning that the next one will be red. Let's have a look around. It's a nice little tail. See how it's looking on the overview. As we is there anything coming here's one leaving so this one might actually be heading to where I am look. no it should be okay so let's go ahead light to green brakes off gear to forward and let's go idea no idea what the best way is for to get the best traction you should gradually increase speed and just go to 100% right away I'll just go to 100% right away no idea if that's the best way but we're making some progress here slowly Me, class 47, 167, a roll freight call. I can see the next signal here ahead is yellow. This little thing here in the tracks will give me a little bell signal, meaning heads up, there's a signal coming. Just turn green, so you don't have to slow down yet. See this train here, the HST, is causing me uh, to have to slow down a bit. It's causing the yellow lights signals. So as long as he is in front of me, I won't be able to go full speed. Not that I'm at full speed. Not nearly at full speed. takes quite a while with all those coal wagons heavy just sort of hear me coming oops, that's that warning Confirmed that by pressing Q, it was warning me that the next signal is yellow, a double yellow in this case, meaning the next one will be a single yellow, and then get a red signal. All caused by this terrain, which is also going very slow, probably be ahead of me for a long time. I have to get to Ditkut reception. Ten miles from where I am now. Show task. Yep, this is where the 
power plant is. It's where I need to pick up some wagons. Not a yellow lock signal. I'll drop off some wagons and I'll pick up some. I guess some D's. Center player. Let's see where we're heading. I'm sent off the main line a bit. It seems I'm already going as fast as the train ahead of me. Oops. Sucks. The other one has to go a bit faster, so it don't get all the yellow signals. So let's hope for that. I can already see the next one is a yellow one, so I'll probably get the exclamation. No, I don't. And it's green. Yep, just turned green as I went around the bend. ETA is 46. Like three minutes after the time that I have to be there. So that will give me some penalty. Even though I did not start that late, I think. It surely did take me more than two minutes to leave, not more than a minute. Nevertheless, I can't make it. I'm afraid. There's a single yellow. Next one is red. I pressed the tab button to Press the spad, signal fast at danger. It's denied as you can see, so I'll have to slow down. It's in no way can I pass a red signal. Because it's very likely the signal will turn yellow before I'm there. I'm hoping that. This is really costing me time. I'm already behind schedule. Keep pressing tab, hoping the signal will change. It won't. You can see the signal. Oh no, it changed. Yep. You can see it slows down real slowly. Because of the, uh, the weight of the train. Now the next signal will be red again. Yep. But there's some uh, distance. Let's see. That's my nemesis. Where am I? Here. Closing in the unit a bit. But no signals for now. So. Ah, that's the first one. It's still red. to go too fast because I need a lot of room to slow down so let's do that safety first people basically I have to wait for this guy to pass the second signal before me he just did so my signal goes green again Still very far away, but so I could have gone faster. But I never know exactly how fast I can go in order to still be able to stop safely before the signal, or hopefully before the signal turns yellow. Lights. Ooh. Ooh, pouch. Never seen those. I've never noticed those. Ooh. Our day full of life. Eat your grass. Give me milk. Milk. Oh wow. Could have animated that a bit. Anyway. Next signal. Already 
configure and I press tab, nothing showing up, so it's okay for me to go there. Now F6 also used to allow me to see or F8 stations, but the names don't show up anymore. I don't know why. Still shows me trains. See, F6 shows you the you. F6 shows you the trains. Also used to show you the station names. Then F7 shows you each separate car number. After the yellow signal, I passed. The next one is red. So, slow it down. This one is come on. Oh, you have a slow. Slow down a bit. <laughs> nice view here. So peaceful and quiet. Signals clear again. Or yellow at least, so picking up the speed for as long as it's allowed basically because this asshole in front of me doesn't know what to move. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Oop, let's hope I saw that at the time. Like, oh, what the hell? Ah, fuck. No, no, no. I was like, why is this? break on but I missed the uh, warning so now the train automatically goes into a full emergency brake meaning no throttle gear in neutral and full brake I'll come to, the, to a full stop losing some points in the way as you can see because I'm using the emergency brake I should never do that I don't want to do that. But hey. At least I can move on a bit now. I won't have to wait for the signals. Whoa, slow to stop. Yeah, man, you can do it. There we go. And stop. And breaks off. To come to a complete stop. Before that, you can't touch anything. You can't take the brakes off or speed up anymore. You have to stop completely, and then it allows you to continue again. So yeah, that sucks. It's like speeding up as slowly as it is when it slows down. But at least I have a clear signal ahead. Let's, let's turn that off. Don't need to know the numbers. You'll see they'll correspond with what I have to drop off. Step 2. Press 3, 5, 0, 6, 3, 4. It's this one. And then 3, 5, 0, 5, 3, 4. You can see it's the second one. They're... Uh, in sequence, so that's easy to spot. And then I have to pick up some new ones. They're already waiting for me at the power station. At the Ash Loop noise. Ooh, station. Careful, people. Hey, nice buttons. No. Just seeing what everything does, basically.
pressing F3 and F4 now, it seems to be just as F1, F3, F4, 5 does nothing, F6 is of course the name tag, F7 the separate pass. And if I have this on, F8 toggles the showing of the next goals, only 3 miles to go. F9, F10, nothing, F11, nothing, and F12 makes a screenshot. It's more of a steam thingy than a game thingy. Let's see how we do it. We are. Yeah. The annoying other train is out of our path already, nice. What is it? Here it is, way ahead of me, because I had to uh, come to a stop, but I'm uh, taking a right turn here anyway, as you can see, let's make sure I, now I did it on time, yes, that warning is, well, first of all I have a yellow light, meaning next one could be red, second of all I have to slow down to 40 and then 25 miles an hour. So I'm already off the front now. A uh, bit longer. I should not have a train ahead of me anymore. I don't. So press tap, signal. Can be passed. That's good. Yeah, yeah. Now off the throttles. Actually my EDA, ETA has gone down by a minute, even though I had to stop. I can make... I made up some time already, maybe I can make up a bit more. But I can't go too fast anymore, let's see, no more trains in the way. Nope, it's all clear. Let's apply the brakes a bit. Halfway. Let's uh, put the next thing on the green, confirming that I've seen it, and no, I have to take some action, which is slowing down here. No, go faster. Uh, a bit too late. I can slow down even more for the 25 miles section. Usually these switches make you go to uh, 50, up to 40 already. So whenever you see the switches. I see light is red, turn green as soon as I came over the switch or the signal in the tracks rather. Now I can just slowly go at speed of 25. Should be in the bend already. Here's the bend. Crossing over uh, one piece of rails here. This one. Very nice. Go into the big bend, and then we'll be meeting these lines here and going around clockwise. You can see the power plant. Oh, the best. Pay attention. See the power plants already in the distance. I don't know if I'm making a circle around that or in front of it. We'll see. Green signal's nice. And you can already see Did Cut Reception 2 is coming up. It's my destination to drop off the cards behind me. hear the clickety clack all the switches long train could be longer okay. in the American scenarios you have even longer trains trains so long you can't even see them when you 
zoom out completely. So let's slow down. Have to come to a stop soon. You see these rails are made for both ways. As I'm looking at the signals on the back. That's uh, slow enough and now as I approach the discord reception too. I'd like to pass the signal with the back side of the train. About halfway past it, this signal. The front is uh, on the section now. What was that for one? Oh, that I'm late, yeah. Got some minus points. Wait a second, I don't have to stop here yet. To go via this waypoint, this could get card reception too. I'm gonna have to take him with me. But if I unload one, which is here. Yep. Drop off all this crap. Gonna have to the back of the Ditcot Ash loop that's here. But make sure I don't go too fast. <laughs> no, I won't because acceleration is a biage. No, I'm making a circle. Up a bit, see where this line is actually. And it goes and it goes in front of the power plant. And we're encircling the whole mountain of coal. Nice, nice. Too fast. Uh, no. I really should be paying attention, more attention to this beast. Up to dip card on that one. Don't really recognize this little signal here in 0.3 miles, but I'm guessing it means I have to do something there. Uncouple in this case. And then I'll probably have to move forward here because I have to attach the rest to the back of my train so I have to move forward to get in here these switches turn around turn around reverse course rather and connect with these and then head on to different parkway 4 here let's slow down we're approaching the stopping point No signals here really, I can just stop it as soon as I'm on it, just like now. And right on the little bridge thingy, whatever that is, we are stopping. Let's go to the cup of view. All the way to the right, see all the wagons here. This is me, the red one, locomotive, and wait. I would say we uncouple, but I'm too trained, of course. I don't uncouple the... No, I don't. You can see by the numbers, the three series, of the five series are the wagons, and the 47 series are the... 47 series are the trains, so I'll uncouple it here. Oh, what the hell? Not correctly. It says here I did. Or I also had to also had to drop the other one. I'll just go back. Can't get points for that anymore, but so coupling. Stopping. And there. What you want, 
Oh, I'm on. <laughs> Accelerating so fast. Okay, let's go. No way to go, but forward. Just rolling out. How far do I have to go? Yeah, these switches. A little bit to go. Just after the bend, you can see the track already here that I need to take. I have to pass the switches, I can do it, uh, I think, in the game world I can switch it, otherwise I can switch it here on the map by holding down shift and then left clicking, you can see, switch junction, just have to pass the junction, Ooh, that switch was not correctly yet. First up, let's see if I can change the switches from the cab. That's pretty nice. We stopped. That's not yet. We stopped. Change the cabs. There we go. This is now forward. Good. Trying to click this now, switches, but it used to let you do that in the world. And I'll quickly do it again. Oh, it's already set, that's so boring. I'll change the last switch, Let's see if I can take that one, if it's wrong. This last switch will take me left and I have to go right, of course. But I cannot. I'm clicking, but I just quickly do it here before I pass. And now speed up. I'll go to the right. What now? Was it one? I don't know. Got some minus points again. Don't know why. Maybe the wheels were spinning. Spinning wheels, loose points. Did you get it from going 100%? Sorry, I can't go much faster, any faster. I don't like this little cross. The assignment was clear, damn you. Am I? I don't want to be surprised by the wagons right around the bend. Uh, plenty of time to break. You see, I'm driving backwards because the little cabin icon, the window icon, as I call it, is here, making it at the front. Slow down a bit so we have a bit more control of how we couple, either at what speed. Couple. There you go. It's already nice and slow. Let us go to the not that one. This one. Oh it's showing the okay. Go down a bit more till four kilometers an hour or miles an hour. No, not yet. Now we are. Begin to drive out and 
Hey, I got an achievement. Work horse. I cobbled 50 times. Ooh. But not a lot. Like, go that way. Speeding up slowly again. Let's see, what do I have now? Well, at least they're empty. So, this. Yeah, you notice they're empty because I'm speeding up. Still not tremendously fast, but faster than when they're full. The ETA is, well, basically now. Well, my ETA is five minutes, but I'm supposed to arrive now. So I'll get a lot of minus points for that. If I even make it at all without getting the cross. As in, eh, well. I hope I got a little check marky. I like check marks, that's cool. Look at the shadow going very oddly. Like that. Where do we have the sun? Oh, too fast. Hello. See? I get distracted and minus points. Guess that's the sun with a. Actually, a darker piece in the center than around. Yep, that's the sun, alright. Okay, let's see. Going to Ditcar Parkway 4. You can see it's in 0.8 miles. Point 0.7 to the beginning of Ditcar Parkway 4. And 0.8 to. Oh. I'm just hoping to end in the positive points, like above zero. I should get some points for getting to the last station. Straight ahead here. That's all straight ahead. Ooh, I can actually go 35. In the next section. But I'm almost there. No, that's just perfect. I have to wait for the entire terrain to pass the signal. You'll see it's still 25 maximum. And now it's at 35. Only until the entire terrain has passed the signal. Slow down because I have no idea how long it takes about ish kind of you know yellow signal next one is red most likely must be not most likely denied but that's okay because I'm not going past it anyway stopping at the station slowly rolling out my train even short enough to fit seems like that might be a tight fit let's see how far I can get this makes no sense why is this intercity express or at least express train Going there, there's nothing there. You can see it's a dead end. Well, it's not a dead end. Trains uh, disappear off the maps. Flying brakes. Not all the way. I want to have my whole train there. The front will easily fit, so. The back is now all the way at the platform so we can come to a stop complete stop there we are four minutes late yeah. could be worse now this thing is full but it might take a few seconds for it to catch up there we go 
finished the scenario but did not complete all steps try again oh, screw you I can't really it was the uncoupling I was looking at this and I did see uh, what's my number 3747 I did not see a 47 number here so I assumed I had to take both trains but apparently I also I only had to keep one train and that cost me the scenario oh well three out of four ain't bad and it's not my fault that it wasn't clear huh anyway thank you for watching see a lot of <laughs> over speeds here Ah, that was the emergency brake setting. You see, you get minus point for every second that you're on emergency brake. So yeah, that uh, adds up, or rather, subtracts very fast. A total of minus 646. No, that can be right. Oh yeah, time limit. Plus 481 here. I have no idea what my end score is, but thank you guys for watching this one. Subscribe to see more from Train Simulator 2013. See you in the next video. Thank you for watching.